everyone welcome back to my channel unless it's your first time then I guess this is hello <laughs> anyways so today is gonna be my quick little haul of what I got in Spain Portugal and France this past month and a half that I've just been traveling so number one on the list might as well just get started otherwise I know I'll keep talking because I just keep talking so I just put it in my hand so that I knew I'd talk about it I got this ukulele the last week I was in France and um, I pretty much got it because I told myself that I was gonna learn how to play the ukulele when I did this three week uh, three days three days of just walking and so um as i walked i held this and i learned how to play c my first song i learned how to play was count on me by bruno mars so if you want to see like a cover of that i could do that i guess actually we're gonna play a game <laughs> i love games if this video gets to 50 likes by the end of two weeks i will post a cover of count on me by bruno mars oh 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 on this ukulele, I got this cute little like bracelet at um, this shop that I'm gonna tell you about. It's called Al Hop. It's like two euros for four things of masking tape, which is so good. At the same store, I got this little cute coin pouch, and it actually isn't a coin pouch. It's like this little thing that held these little wishing people you put under your pillow to make you feel better. But I just thought that was a little creepy, so I didn't do that in Sevilla got this brush it's a wooden brush with wooden bristles and so I've been searching for so long for a wooden bristle brush wooden brushes bristle brushes are the best thing for you because they absorb the natural oils in your hair and so then when you brush all your hair it evenly distributes the oils throughout your hair so it's the best option when you brush your hair now for all you boys out there watching my videos let's talk about knives so I feel like I really shouldn't be playing this. Oh, I don't know how to close this. Just kidding, figured it out. <laughs> if you've seen Lord of the Rings, you know how they have all the cool swords and stuff like that. All of the swords were made in Toledo. Isaac, which is my friend that I went with, Kim, he got his um, friends these knives. And so here is this really cool knife. And um, yep, that's for one friend that I'm delivering it to. And then he got this really cool like sword. Um, it's not that sharp, so that's good because we don't want to have to hurt ourselves. But um, anyways, legit, you can't tell me this is not like super cool. It's really, really heavy. Also, in Barcelona, I got this cute little cacti. So I was afraid that I wouldn't be able to get him over to America because it's a plant. You know, you're not supposed to do that. Um, but I did it, and I put it in my bag, and it was okay. So pretty much it's just a little tiny cacti and this little tiny mug that says Barcelona on the side. And I love it so much, and I'm so happy, and I named him Steve, I think. And then I got this random little world glow because I really liked it and it's glitchy. So, yep. Oh, almost threw that in my coffee. I found this coconut body milk at the airport and I'm just gonna like show it to you guys. Um, pretty much when you spray it, it comes out like a, it comes out like a spray. Oh, it smells so good and it's like milky. It's like liquid, but it turns into like lotion as you rub it on your body. It's like your lotion melted. So cool. Okay, next. Um, I got clothes, but I'll do those last. Okay, so I also got another journal because I saw this journal and I fell in love with it. It just says to travel is to live and it has like a bunch of like travel aesthetics on there that I love. So this is gonna be like my bullet journal for YouTube and like all my ideas, etc. etc. Next on the list. Um, in the beginning of the trip-ish, I got this little fan that plugs into a charger. Portable like things that you keep with you. Thank you, Jesus, for fans. Ah. Alright, now we're on to the clothing portion. So boys, um, if you want to go now, you can go now. There's no more cool swords or anything. First on this list of clothes that I got, it's a little wrinkled, but it is a dress that I got from a place called Mango, which is so cute. It's like all over on Europe. And um, it's pretty much an off the shoulder and it has a cute little wrap that goes around your waist and I legit love how it like flares out on the bottom. Ugh, it's so pretty and I feel so pretty in it. And <laughs> did you guys ever watch Dragon Tales, Dragon Tales when you were a kid? Because I did. Love it. Like wheezy, you know? Okay. Then I also got this cute little number and um, I had to tie the top little things when I was in Spain because it would like fall a little too low and I was like, ah. I'm not ready to be that European. So I really enjoyed this and I almost didn't get it. I legit went back in and tried it on again. I'm that funny, I know. So it has this really cute tie and I really love that. And then it's a jumpsuit so it just keeps going. And um, I love how the pants flare out. And yet I can put a sweater on top of this and it just looks like I'm wearing these really cool flare pants with a sweater. So 
I love that and this was such a like a go-to travel item and I didn't even realize it when I bought it and I legit wore it so much and it's super comfortable so I got that at a store called pull and bear which is also very very frequently seen in Europe and then I got a pair of jeans because I need a pair of jeans so I got these also from pull and bear I love them they're I mean they're really simple except they're super like legit jean fabric if that it's describable. They are definitely like mom jeans, but I got them to fit me like really nice and like secure. So they're not like baggy mom jeans, they're just like mom jeans that fit me well. I feel like I just totally like used all the wrong words possible. But that's okay. So um guys, that was the end. I probably forgot like a couple of things that I got in Spain that are just sitting around my room somewhere. But that's okay. Maybe I'll just insert them in if I did. No, I don't think I did. Why is it beeping at me? I don't know. Wait, I have to go. Okay, I love you guys so much. Thanks for tuning in and watching till the end if you did because that is awesome and I really appreciate you. Um, can you like comment down below and answer this question for me? How do you like your tea? That's what I want to know. I want to know how you like your tea. And then I'll know you made it to the end of the video. <laughs> I will see you next for another video whenever it comes out.